Hi Taurus, we are doing confession time readings. Yes, we are. Or hidden truth, revealing some hidden truth. Either one, either we're going to get confessions about something or we're going to get the hidden truth about something. Yeah, guys, if this re uh, reading doesn't resonate for you, check out your other sign position. Sometimes your moon, your Venus or rising signs will resonate. And I also do the extra wild card reading. You can check that one out and see if I picked up your energy in that one. So let's jump in. Let's find out what your person is going to confess or what truth they're going to reveal to us. This is for my Taurus. Ooh, y'all know the deck's going to fight me. Ooh. Let's do this again, guys. <laughs> for my Taurus. Oh, that felt better. Yeah. We got no judgment going on here. Confess whatever you want. Mm -hmm. Tell us anything you want. What happens in Vegas stays in Vegas, y'all. Mm -hmm. Hold no judgment. This is for my Taurus in their person. Ooh. Mm -mm -mm. Let's get this energy right, guys. My Taurus. My Taurus. Let me down a little bit. Okay. It's for my Taurus. Their person. Their person want to bring forward. Ooh. We might have to take two, guys. <laughs> it's okay. We'll take them. First one, we've got, I wonder if you are happy without me. I wonder if you are happy without me. I'm becoming a better person. Oh. I wonder if you are happy without me. I'm becoming a better person. Let's pull the uh, Romance Angel Oracles. This is for my Taurus. Let's pick up a little bit more energy on the person coming forward. A bit more energy on the person coming forward, please. It's for my Taurus and their person. My Taurus is person. Just a little bit more energy on what they're wanting to talk about. I wonder if you are happy without me. I'm becoming a better person. Yes, I am. What's the energy with it? Are we going to get one, guys? Going to get one here? Mm -hmm. We are. We are. Let's see what we got. Trust. This situation is calling for you to have faith. Faith. Ooh, so my Taurus. We've definitely got someone that we're broken from. Mm -hmm. We're without them. <laughs> uh, they're, they're wanting us to know they are becoming a better person. And they're also acknowledging uh, you may not trust that. Yeah, you may not trust it when they're saying that. So, yeah. Mm. Let's go ahead and pull the tarot. Which deck do we want to use for my Taurus? Mm, which deck is calling to us, guys? I'm seeing the Finestra Tarot. Let's use the Finestra deck. Okay, this is for my Taurus. We're going to get a little more on the circumstances that is surrounding this hidden truth in this confession. One more on the circumstances for my Taurus and their person. What's going on? Tell us about the circumstances, that one. Anything else? Give us some more. There it is. Oh, that one's wanting to fly. Which one? Can't tell. Just keep going here. Maybe it'll come out again. There it is. Anything else? Yep, there it is. I'm filling the bottom one. Let's see what we got. What's going on? We've got a seven of cups. Mm -hmm. It's about making choices, different options. Oh, three of swords, heartache. 
Seven of Swords. Ooh, unseen. Okay. The Moon card pattern. We got a Pisces energy on that Moon card. Seven of Cups. Mm -hmm. And then we got a reversed Ace of Wands. Reversed. Mm, just what this is telling me that this person, while we were in a connection with them, was doing a lot behind our back and seemed to have had a pattern of doing it. <laughs> uh, playing the field. A lot of choices. Mm -hmm. That was causing a lot of heartache, and they were sneaking doing it. Uh, yeah. Seven of uh, Swords is about thievery, having stuff taken from you, uh, what you're not seeing, things like that. So, yeah, this is definitely saying we had someone that was making choices that was breaking our heart. And they were sneaking around doing it. Maybe a pattern for them. An actual pattern for them. With that moon card, you know, our moon goes in cycles and stuff. That's a pattern. Ah, and they killed the passion. They definitely killed the passion in the, the connection between us. So, yeah. Oh, okay. Let's see what their true desires are in the situation. Let me get these laid where I can see them a little bit. Let's find out their true desires in, uh, for the connection. What is the true desires pulling deep into the heart? True desires. What are their true desires? Why are they bringing that confession forward to us? True desires. First card. True desires for my Taurus is person. Hmm. True desire. Hmm. I just pushed it back, that one. True desire. True desire. There it is. Nope. Not feeling those. True desires. Hmm. That one right there feels like a little cinder block here. Hmm. We've got a tower, divine intervention, page of wands, page of wands. It's representing our fire energies, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energies. Knight of Pentacles, mm, Virgo energy. Mm. And three of wands. Let me pull a little bit more because the, basically what they, what they are saying for real is they know, they know, they, they uh, messed up big time that tower, the tower card. But it's also, they're, they're also, it's a double fold message. It's, it's it, them acknowledging they ruined your the connection between you. But it's also them uh, sending out prayers to the universe to get you back for another chance. There's our page of wands. They still, they still, uh, they're like, um, I still got the flame for you. Even though they burned it out with us, they're still holding passion, holding out passion. But it's a page. There's not really any direction of where to take the action, what to do, where to direct that energy. They, they're they standing in a, I don't know what to do, but I'm feeling it kind of energy. Uh, they want, they're trying to be realistic and practical. They want to approach us. They really do. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And they, they would really like to approach us. The Three of Wands is the Young Empress. Young Empress. Uh, most of the time we have ships out here in, in the bay. Uh, where we're standing and going, is my ship leaving without me? Or is it coming in? That kind of thing. So yeah, our per this person is definitely their true desires is to try to uh, get us back. Yeah. To move forward. Um, rekindle the, the, the flame passion uh and yeah they and they like i'll go i'll go slow if we, we need to go slow with that uh virgo energy there yeah true but their true desire is let's pull on that three of wands let's see a little bit more on that three of wands and the knight of pentacles we're going to clarify on those 
clarify our Virgo Knight of Pentacles energy and that young Empress. Please clarify that. Give us a little more detail, please. The Taurus is person. Clarifying on um, that Knight of Pentacles there. Oh, got Hermit Virgo energy again. Hermit Virgo energy and two swords. Mmm, it's reversed. I don't know if it's reversed because the way it flipped out, it may just be the way I picked it up. Yeah, hold on. I need more than that. That one. Oh, young emperor. Standing in Paul's mode. And there we got it. The two cups. Two cups. That, that confirms most definitely. Um... They're, they're really hoping. <laughs> right now they're feeling really alone. With that Virgo energy. Both of these are Virgo energies. And so yeah. Virgo energy is playing a predominant thing, uh, energy in our reading. Uh, they are feeling very alone right now. Hopefully it's also representing they're getting some insight into their self. And, and what you know. What they, they've been doing that ruined the connection. Two of Swords is they're really hoping that, uh, they, they're, it's representing they don't know what to do. They don't know, really don't know what to do. But they're hoping that you will choose them. They, it's like, choose to let them come back. Cause we've got our Emperor and Empress here, the young version, standing in that paused mode. Hoping, standing in the pause mode, hoping, making a decision that you'll take them back. And our Two of Cups is not so much a commitment card. It's about making compromises and sacrifices within a relationship. You know, most of the time we want that healthy balance where both are making compromises and sacrifices to balance out the scales where we don't mind making compromises and sacrifices. But this person is hoping that you forgive them. And yeah, it's a bit, it's, it would be a big sacrifice and compromise on your part to forgive uh, what you know they've done. So yeah. That's their true desire. Let's see what their intentions are. Do they have any intentions? What's in their thoughts? Any intentions? What kind of actions are they planning on taking? Or hoping to take? I shouldn't say plan. Well, they are planning it. But, you know, it takes nerve to actually put it into action. We can think about it, but that don't mean we're actually going to do it. <laughs> Hopefully that makes sense to you. It's their intentions. Getting into their thoughts. That bottom one's going to want to pop. Mm, six of Wands. Hang on to it. Six of Wands. Mm -hmm. Judgment. Momentum. Mm -hmm. What else? What else? Wishes. And bottom one reversed on a page of Swords. Okay, guys, so what we got based on, mm, let me pull them and read them in order here for us. So with this one, they're going to try to prove, take action to prove, visually show you that um, I'm becoming a better person. Because um, they want to gain your faith and trust back. So, yeah. But they're going to try to prove to you. As much as I hate saying this, this is a Leo energy. <laughs> and sometimes Leos will, you know, their center stage, they'll put on an act for us. Uh, to get us to change our mind, judgment, rekindle, redo. It's a resurrection card to resurrect. Uh, they're going to start moving fast, <laughs> yeah, on whatever actions they're planning on. The action seems to be, I hate saying it, guys. <laughs> Taurus, I'm sorry. To put on a performance for us, to, to try to show us, because uh, they want the what they're hoping and wishing for, the nine of cups. But then we got the page of swords. There, there's they got doubts that they don't know what to do. 
we've got another page. Pages, you know, are the youthful one in the suits that normally wait to get direction of what do I need to do. We call them messengers, things like that, but they actually don't know what, you know, what kind of message to give until they get the orders from, you know, higher up. It's like, I don't have my direction. I don't know what to do yet. They got a lot of doubt, but their mind is focusing on what could I do to show and prove to you that I've changed because that's their real desire and they really want back fast. They want to act fast before they lose you completely. But the fact that we did get, like I said, we got the page of, there he is, or her, <laughs> Page of Swords reversed. They 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 doubt and they're gonna take. They don't know what to do. So they're probably not gonna take any actions. But at least you, you know what their mind is centering on. How to prove to you to get you know a resurrection, hoping and dreaming, and they they really want to do it fast. They want things to to you know pick up momentum and go fast. So yeah, let's pull the tarot in translation. This is advice from your higher self, from your guides and the divine, my Taurus. This is for you on what to focus on, what advice for this connection. What will your higher self, the divine, your guides uh, advise for you to give some attention to or focus on when it comes to this person. Let's see what we'll get. This is for my oh, first one out. Anything else? Is there anything else? Oh, yeah, that one. Anything else? Oh, yeah, we got two more. Let's see what we're getting here, guys. King of Wands, charismatic, passionate, and inspiring. You're ready to take this, take the lead when it comes to love and your connection. Let your heart be your guiding force. Your heart be your guiding force. Nine of Swords, you're letting your internal fears get the better of you by repeating negative beliefs or mindsets, creating turmoil within yourself in your connection. Bring your focus away from fear and back to love. Away from fear and back to love. Two of Pentacles, you or your partner might be neglecting your relationship in favor of other priorities. Focus on the undercurrent of love between you to rebalance the connection. And three of pentacles, continue to have faith in the divine unfolding of your sacred union. Through your co-creating with your partner, you're birthing a powerful em embodiment of love. Ooh, a powerful three of pentacles. Mm. Okay, let's go ahead and give your person a chance to give you a brief message. Which deck am I being drawn to? Give me a minute to figure out which deck. We're going to go with the shadow end of the deck and we're using the roses. Just because there's some thorns about. Ew. Yeah. Let's see if this is the right deck. Mm, possibly, yes. This is for my Taurus's person. Please allow them to come forward and speak a brief message. There's no judgment on our parts. Mm -mm. We're not passing any judgment. Share anything you want to say. Anything you want to say? Is there anything you like to say with this deck? Oh. Mm. Are we going to get anything? Yeah, we're going to get one. Might have to switch out the decks because I'm mm, not sure your person's really feeling this one. Mm. There's one and two. Let's see what we're getting. And I may switch off decks. The timing just wasn't right for us. Mm -hmm. You deserve so much more than I can give you. I wish I could make you see that they don't deserve your love. Use your intuition for all of us. That may not resonate. 
but there's maybe someone else already or yeah I become obsessed with you and it scared me let's switch off decks we're gonna go to which one conversation with counterparts we're still in the shadow end of the deck my Taurus For my Taurus's person, please allow them to come forward, give a brief message, anything they want to say, anything at all they want to say. Oh yeah, there's our first one. I'm making my way back to you. Oh, oh. Mm, taking that one. Not feeling those guys, but that one, yes. Oh, there's another one. Anything else? Anything else? Oh, my Taurus in their person. Yep. See what we're getting here. I'm learning to love myself again. Learning, mm hmm Becoming a better person. Learning to love myself again. I miss our friendship. Miss our friendship. I made a mistake. I made a mistake. What else? Anything else? Mm-hmm. Ooh, they're talking through this deck. Yes, they are. You're getting them here. And this one over there. Let's see what we got. I'm not ready for us yet. I'm not ready for us yet. Mm-hmm. That could be that reversed uh, page of swords or what did we get? Page of wands, page of swords. Yeah. Not sure about things yet. Mm -hmm. Please don't give up on us now. Mm -hmm. I don't feel worthy of you. Don't feel worthy of you. I'm awakening to what this love really means. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they still got a little hesitance of, and the biggest thing to know that's. Uh, causing a lot of their standoff is their doubt not moving forward like i said with their intentions we got that reverse page of the they're probably not going to take any actions they're they're thinking about it yeah but they're right now they're just doubting everything this is what's causing it i don't feel worthy of you because of what they've done so yeah let's go ahead and pull a lover's oracle this is for my taurus Ooh, we got our first pop Anything else? Anything else for my Taurus? Anything else? There you go. Which one is it? Well, we're going to take three guys because I'm second guessing. And when I second guess, it's just better for me not to second guess. Wait. Don't rush into it. Allow nature to take its course. Mm -hmm. This one. Close your eyes and tell yourself that you deserve to feel joyful. You can allow joy into your life regardless of the circumstances you currently find yourself in. Mm -hmm. And then our dove. You may not always understand why certain things happen. However, there is always a higher purpose to the events in your life. Through turmoil, a blessing will soon be revealed. Yes, it will. Okay, my Taurus, that's all I have for us, guys. I'm sending you love and light. Many, many blessings as always. Thank you so much for visiting my channel. Hope I'll see you again next time. Bless be.